Hello everyone, what's going on? How's everyone doing today? If you're jumping on, say hey. If you are catching a replay, comment hashtag replay. What's going on today? What is everyone doing? I'm so excited because I, I took a nap. Well, this is what I did today. I um, helped Matt with a literary analysis essay. Hi, Donna. I helped Matt with a literary analysis essay. That was fun. It took me, worked on it for about five hours. And then after that, I passed out on the couch for about two hours. And I woke up. And hi, Alyssa. Hello. I woke up from my nap. And I got my pharmacy box. I'm so excited. I can't wait to open this up. So, um, I'm drinking tea right now because my stomach is killing me. I had way too much mac and cheese earlier. So I'm going to open this box. I'm like so pumped and I have like all this stuff in front of me right now. Let me actually, I look like crap right now. I'm wearing like this ratty tea. It's not even white anymore. I'm going to just pull my hair back. So I have no makeup on right now. And as you can see, what I'm really excited to try is like the CC cream and the VFX foundation because I have a lot of melasma from sun damage. Um, oh, I just want to get this out of my face. Um, right up here, you can see it's all like, you can like see it. It's all like brown. And every foundation that I buy doesn't cover it. Um, and I've bought like really expensive stuff before. And nothing like it'll cut like it'll cover a little bit, but you'll still see it there. Um, so let's see. This is like Christmas. I was so excited. I was waiting all day for this to come, and I was like, "Oh, it's probably just gonna come while I'm napping," and it did. Ugh. Let's see what I got. Oh my God, I should have brought scissors over here, a knife or something. Oh my God, I look like crap right now. I think I might go out later too. I'm not sure yet. Um, hello. This is not working. There we go. Jesus Christ. Ooh. I'm like the worst allergies today. I don't know if anyone else is suffering like I am. So if I'm blowing my nose in front of you guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's just like, won't stop running. Okay, let's see. What do I got? Like, seriously, just ordered this stuff like four days ago and I already forgot what I ordered. Okay. Goodies, I have goodies. My dog's down there looking at me like, hi, Todd. My dog's, my dog's on the floor looking at me like, what are you doing? All right, so to start, I got the double-sided brush. <laughs> Todd. <laughs> I got the double-sided brush, which will be great for um, eyes and face. So there's that. Here's the CC cream. I got the light to medium. Is that what I got? Yeah, light to medium. And this is probably because I have um, like a Maybelline BB cream that I'm using right now and it's awful. Like it does nothing. Uh, let's see. I ordered the, here's the VFX. Minimizes pores in line. Oh no, this is the primer. Sorry. Um, so this is the primer that you put on before your makeup. I think I got the one that's not shimmery. Like I got a matte one. Because I have really oily skin, so I didn't want to get one that was, like, going to give me, a, like, a sheen. Yeah, so this is, like, just the regular, the regular primer. And my friend always says it's a crime not to prime. So I'm going to use that. So I'm going to use that. Probably just throw away these boxes because I'm not selling these products, so. Like that. All right, I got, here's the VFX, um... The VFX foundation, full coverage, we shall see, because i got to get rid of this crap up here. 
so let's see, what color did I get? I got the 04. I think that looks like my skin. Looks like my skin. I'm not sure if I got the right concealer though. I might have gotten a concealer too dark. Um, where's my concealer? Oh, that's not the concealer. Yeah, I don't know where my concealer is, but this is the transparent finishing powder. I love the casing. Like it's so like modern and sleek looking. Um, oh my god, my phone. Is this stuff like glued shut? Is it tape shut? Oh my god, my phone needs to stop going off. I seriously can't open this thing. Like legit can't open it. I don't know what's going on here. What the hell? There we go. So this is the finishing powder. Nice. Oh, it's got a thing on top of it. Oh my god. What is happening here? I think it is a thing on it. Oh, there we go. Throw that away. That's really smooth. It's so smooth. Ooh, it smells good. Right. Then I've got... What did I get? Oh, I got a makeup... Um, a brush set. So this is four brushes. We've got one for like lips and eyes. Uh, I probably eyebrows actually. Um, eyeshadow. Probably like foundation, concealer, or bronzing. And it's like, oh, these feel really nice. This is that. Adorable. <laughs> Then I've got, is this my concealer? No, this is the brow, where is my concealer? In here somewhere. This is the eyebrow mascara. So I'm interested to really, so I have this huge thing with like, my two, thi like I would say the, the two types of products that I have the most in my closet are lip stuff and eyebrow stuff. Cause I'm always looking for the perfect type of eyebrow stuff. So I have like pencils, I have, powders I have like these ones that are like they're like um I don't know they're like this it's like a powder stick but it always flakes all over my face I have a I had another mascara one the brush was awful I think it was Maybelline the brush was awful and it's like just globby it's not like an eyebrow brush it's like a it's I don't know it's awful and then there's something else I used I don't know like a I think like a liquid pencil kind of thing so I'm always looking for like the perfect type of eyebrow stuff and because I like a nice I like a nice uh what am I trying to say like a nice solid brow so we've got this oh this is gonna be good I can tell because it's not like wicked wet that was the problem with the other one the Maybelline one when you pulled it out it was globby and wet everywhere so when you put it on your face it was like wet you had to just like clean it away. It was like a, a mess. So there's that. Then I've got, ooh, my three-in-one face palette. This is blush, bronze, and highlighter face palette. And I know the colors are, I've seen these colors, so they're really nice. You can use them on your eyebrows. Um, sorry, your eyebrows, your uh, eye, um, oh my God, your eyelids. I almost said eyelashes. This is really pretty. Look at those colors. Pretty. Why does all their makeup smell so good? It, like, really smells good. It's weird. Does that? I like forgot I ordered so much crap. Like this is crazy. Um, eyebrow pomade. So see here again, I'm trying to find the perfect eyebrow thing. So I, w I wanted to try the pomade as well. So I'll use that little brush, the flat looking brush that I have, for this stuff. Let me see how this one feels. Yeah, see, that's really smooth. I had another one that was, like, really dry. So that one feels really good. So there's that. Then I've got creamy eyeshadow. And again, I really like the casing that they use. It's really pretty. Um, creamy eyeshadow. Pink glow. So this is, like, a really soft pink. 
And I'm like really into like the rosy colors for fall this year. Ooh, this is really pretty. Like, look at that. I don't even know if you can see it. I don't even know if you can see it. That's really pretty. And it's so silky. Oh, and it stays really well, too. All right, so there's that. And then another one. I think this is the green one that I got. I was really excited to see this one because I love green. Oh, Jesus. Of course, I'm propping this against my iPad. I need to get like a real stand. Oh, yeah. This is the... I don't know why I'm smelling it. <laughs> it's like a foresty green color. Oh my god, it's so silky. Jesus. I don't know if you can see that. It's really pretty. I might use this one tonight. We shall see. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. All right. And I've got... The Star Look Mascara. This is the most expensive mascara we have. All our products are really, they're very well priced. Um, but this one is the most expensive. I think it's like 19. All of our other ones are cheaper. But I really wanted to try this one because I've seen it being used by other people and it looks amazing. And then I've got all this other fun stuff. So this is all trash. I don't need that. Ooh. Take a sip of my tea. I have chicken wings in the oven. I'm probably going to have to flip them soon. All right, let's see what else I got. I know I got another mascara, too. I hope it's in here. Is this the mascara? Yeah, so I also got the Zen mascara. This one's cheap. I can't remember, but I think it's like 9 or $10 or something. It might even be cheaper than that. So this is Extension Lash Mascara. I wanted to try the Zen one as well. We have, I think, like six different mascaras, and I'll probably eventually get them all just so I can try them. And then I got, oh, here's my concealer. Now, I'm not really sure if I got the right color. Mm. Yeah, I don't think I did. So, that definitely doesn't really look like the right color. If anyone wants a full, and I heard that these concealers are so, so good. So, I'm like really sad that I can't use this right now. Uh, but this is a pure beige color. If anyone thinks they need it. Um... I really don't, this might be too dark compared to the, yeah, it's really hard to tell, but this might be too dark for me. So there's that. And then I got, what is this? Oh, the uh, liquid eyeliner, I think. Stare off. Hi, Jamie. So here's the liquid eyeliner. Do, 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 do. Oh, I really like that this pen wasn't like too thin because I have other ones that are like just too thin so there's that and oh and then I got, I got excited for these these are the um like the metallic and shimmer eyeliners I got two I'm really excited to like fiddle with these so I got the gold one or I think it's gold or bronze I'm not sure I think this is the gold one and then I got the green one. It's so pretty. So pretty. Okay, so there's those. And then I got some lipsticks. Did I get all mattes? I can't remember. Let me see. Because I love matte. Matte is like my thing. So I got... Yeah, I think I got three mattes. The, um, what is this one called? I think this one's Brave, but I don't see the, the name on here. Oh, no, this is Brave. So what is this one? This one is number 60, but it doesn't have a name on it. I'm not sure which one, what this one's called. Well... It's beautiful, whatever it is. I'm not sure what color it, it is, but it's very pretty. And then I've got Brave, and then I've got Wild Rose, which is more like a red. So, let's see. What do I want to do tonight? Well, I'm going to start with 
Let me start with this primer. Start with the primer. It's a crime not to prime. Oh yeah. That smells good too. Mm -hmm. It feels so nice. Oh, it's like jellyish, but like really soft. Oh, it smells so good. And I have a lighted mirror next to me over here, so if I look over here to look at what I'm doing, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> this feels really nice. And I guess you're supposed to let it sit for a few minutes, so. It feels really nice. Give me one second. I'm going to flip my chickens. Hold on. All right, I'm back. Sorry, I gotta blow my nose again. My nose is running. Ugh. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Ugh. No shame in my game. My allergies are killing me. All right, so I'll just say it's done. It hasn't been five minutes, that's all right. Um, all right, I wanna try the CC cream and then I'm just gonna try it on one side of my face for now, and then I wanna see, and then I'm gonna, I don't know, we'll see what I do. I'll figure it out. I feel like you guys can't see me. This is a nice color. You know what, I'm gonna use foundation brush, I think, for this. Should I use this, maybe? I don't know. I don't know what I wanna do. I don't know if I use that. Mm. This stuff like smells really good. Mm. I don't think this is the right kind of brush for this because this is not blending well. It's like too fluffy. I have this brush I'm gonna use. This is an expensive brush though. I got it at MAC. I'll try this. Oh, there we go. That's better. I really wish I got a different concealer because I really wanted to try it. You can already see the difference because I have a lot of like freckles and stuff too. I have like a lot of discoloration. So and that's like the perfect color for me. This is really nice. Smells good. I don't know why all their products have smell good. I think I even used too much. I probably don't even need to use this much because it's like it blends so good. If anyone's on here, tell me what's going on. Talk to me. What's everyone doing? What is everyone doing tonight? But I gotta do my eyebrows. I gotta do my eyebrows. I'm like hearing something. I don't, it sounds like it's raining out. Oh no. It's just my chicken sizzling in the oven. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> this is really nice for CC cream. Like, I mean, I've never tried a CC cream. I've always done BB cream. But this is like really nice. It actually... It actually, um... It could just be used as a foundation. 
but as you can see, it looks like my um, stuff is still showing. So we're going to see if that VFX foundation covers that. And I'm going to use my this thingy for that to see if I can kind of pat it in better. All right, there we go. I'm pumped. Oh. First time using the VFX. I'm excited. Hey, Crystal, how are you? I can't get it out. Come on. Why is it not coming out? All right, it should be coming out. There we go. Now I can feel it. It is really hard to see yourself like in this. So I'm gonna look over here. This is like really nice looking. This is like the perfect shade for me too. I was like worried that I got. <laughs> I already love it, Crystal. This stuff's so nice. Um, I was afraid that I got the wrong color, but this is like this is definitely my color. Cause I am pretty fair, so. I am fair, and this feels so good. That chicken is really sizzling in the oven. It sounds like it's pouring outside. <laughs> oh yeah, that looks so good. Let's do a tiny bit more for my forehead. Let's see if I can cover up that melasma. That melasma. Yeah, like I was using a MAC foundation that I spent like almost $40 on. And it wasn't even that great. I mean, it was good, but it wasn't even that great. And the girl who like color matched me at the store didn't even pick out the right color for me. It was like too tan. Which I like to be tan, but if it doesn't match my body, then it just is just silly. That looks perfect. And I think... Like you can still see a little bit up here, but it doesn't look that bad. It's just like right here. Definitely looks way better. It looks good. That's nice. Mm. Love it. Love it. Perfect color. All right, now, yeah, I think this, um, I think this concealer is going to be too dark. You know what? I kind of want to try it, though. Kind of want to try it. Well, maybe it'll work. Because I definitely have purple under my eyes. You can see it. Oh, yeah, purple. Under my eyes, I have purple. Under my eyes. Alright, so another thing about concealer too, like, I was using this other one that I got in Ipsy Bag, and, um, it was awful. It would, like, cake and this doesn't do that color is probably not light enough for me but I'm gonna use some of that finishing powder okay so now we're gonna do some of this fun stuff Let's see what I got here got this let me get my brushes. Let me get my brushes. Figure out what brush I'm going to use for this stuff. This smells so good. I don't know why. It just does. It smells really good. 
I'm just doing a little contour. Just a little contour. Looks good. It looks good. Oh. Just so you guys can see what I'm doing. This highlight was beautiful. Look at that. So pigmented. Oh my goodness. So pigmented. <laughs> I need like a different brush. I need a different brush. Mm. I'll just use this one. It's fine. This is so pretty. I'm like obsessed with this highlighter. Goodness. Like, <laughs> it's nuts. Look at that glow. I don't even know if you guys can see it. The glow looks really pretty. Nice little glow, a little glow. Okay, let's put some blush on, a little bit. I'm gonna look in the mirror over here. Beautiful. All right, let's get that powder. Yeah, this looks really good. Just make sure it's even because you yeah. freaking OCD. Okay, so let's do the powder. Oh my God, again, I can't open this goddamn thing. Why is this not opening? I'm like really obsessed with this contour kit because this looks so pretty. Like you can see the glow, you can see everything. It's so beautiful. Now we're gonna take some of this powder. Probably don't even really need this little thingy it came in. I don't really use those. I'm just going to put some under the eyes, make the glow. Mm -hmm. mm, this stuff smells so good. All right. I'm pretty obsessed with these products already because my face looks fabulous right now. 
looks clear, shiny, beautiful. Love it. They smell so good. All right, so now what am I going to do? All right, um, let's do, what do I want to do? Let's do, oops, sorry. Grab my eyeshadow brush. I forgot I have the, oh, my eyebrows. Can't forget about the eyebrows, most important part. You know what? I'm going to try this mascara stuff and see what this looks like. Sorry, I'm going over here so I can see my mirror. Oh, this is good. This is nice. I don't know how people do it when they look into this thing. It's like impossible. So, what I like about this is that it looks natural. Like, your eyebrows aren't like wicked like crazy. Honestly, this is probably going to be my new obsession. This is like unbelievable. This is nuts. That looks good. Just did something really weird right there. So I got like empty spots in my eyebrows. When I was younger, I friggin' walked into a hydrant or something and I had a scar there, and so I had like this empty section of my eyebrow. But what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Love this product. Hi, Michelle. Miss you, girl. Hi, Janice. Now I can see why this is like my friend Alyssa's like obsession because that just looks really natural. I'm used to using um, a pencil, and it doesn't look that natural. Picking the front couple stragglers there. That looks good. Love that. Oh, I miss you, girl. Alright, now let's do some eyeshadow. I better go out after all this freaking hard work. If I stay in the house now, I'm gonna be pissed. So I'm actually gonna use my contouring palette to do some eyeshadow. I feel like my eyebrows aren't even. Whatever. They look fine. Um, I'm probably going to use... Um, I might actually use all three colors, so I'm going to start with the brown shade. Full pharmacy face. Full pharmacy face. And I love like I'm gonna like those kind of colors on, on your eyes, like for the fall, that pinkish color. I love it. And this is like this brown is the perfect brown for your eyes, it really is. So perfect.
I'm just building it up, making it dark, because I like it dark. And I have really hooded eyebrows, so, I mean, eyelids, so it's like, sometimes you can't even see the makeup. You gotta go over it like 50 million times. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Okay. So, there's that. Sizzling chicken in the oven is really freaking me out. It sounds like it's pouring outside. All right, now we're going to do this pink on the side. And I'm just kind of just putting this color more on like the inner half. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that cream that I got. I'm going to take that cream, this one, this pink one. I'm going to put some of this on there too. I'm just going to dab it with my finger. Oh, that's nice. I am like seriously blown away by the quality of this makeup. Look at how pretty that looks. blend it and of course I got it up there and I didn't want to do that Hi, Sue. I love this freaking color. It's so pretty. It's like perfect for fall. I'm just going to blend it in a little bit. Blend it. I'm going to darken the outsides a little bit too. Just puff in those corners, the outer corners. And now, what I'm going to do on the inner corners, it looks like it's uneven because the light's coming from the side, but it's pretty even. Hi Troy. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this little brush and I'm going to take the in the highlighter and I'm going to do the inner corners of my eyes like right in the corner. Just add a little pop. Little glow. Just makes me look more like lively and awake. Okay, now 
I might do a little bit of the brown along the bottom part. Just kind of give some color down here. My boyfriend hates when I do this color on my eyes because he says it looks like I'm sick. I think it's pretty though. Guys don't know what they're talking about. So this kind of gives it a little more of like a smoky look. Can't really see in this lighting, which sucks, but. I don't know if I want to do any eyeliner today. Well, maybe I'll do a little bit. Let's see how I feel. I do have that gold that I could throw on. That looks nice. Give it a little smoky look. Now I'm really bad with eyeliner, but you know what? I think I'm just gonna give it a shot. Where's the liquid eyeliner? Let's see if I can do this. I am loving this glow. This looks so good. I'm probably gonna fuck this up. I'm gonna make it really bad at this. Mm -hmm. I definitely like this eyeliner because it's um, not too thin. I'm like not even looking at the camera. I don't really know how to do a wing. So I'm not really gonna try. I'm just gonna kinda do this for now. So this is what I'm gonna do for now. It still looks good though. I definitely like this eyeliner. This is really pretty. Because it's not too thin, like I was saying, like some other eyeliner sticks are, not sticks, but like these things are way too thin. And this one's not that thin. Like it's perfect. Sorry guys, I'm just going to look away. Someone did say recently like how relaxing it is to watch someone put makeup on and it's really true like I'll get sucked into watching someone put makeup on for like two hours isn't even but I feel like it's not even on one side. Hi, Michelle.
So, I am noticing right now it's very hard for me to do a um, winged liner because I have a lot of like wrinkles over here when I go like that. So it's like getting all messed up. And I'm ruining my makeup by trying. <laughs> so I don't know what to do. Fix it a little bit, but I'm going to try to fix it on the other side. Jesus, I had no idea I actually had wrinkles in my eyes. I need like a little bit of like water or something so I can fix this. Well, this eye, this mascara like doesn't come off of an eyeliner. <laughs> At least we know it works good. I'm probably gonna like take a little wet cloth and like wipe this off. If anyone knows how to do winged liner, can you like hit me up? Wow, this stuff like really stays on because this is nuts. Thanks, Michelle. I just screwed up my eyeliner, though. Now you know what happens. This, like, eyeliner is so... It does not come off, and now it's like... Well, I know it works. But... I did screw up my eyeshadow. So, we're just going to take a little bit of this. When in doubt, cover up. Just cover it up. Sometimes I'll put like some eyeshadow on top of eyeliner too to kind of soften the black. Because I'm very fair anyway, so sometimes I feel like this kind of eyeliner like looks really like severe on me. Sometimes. Well, I did the best I could at fixing it. Where's the... Does anyone know how to like know how to know when chicken wings are done in the oven? They've never cooked chicken wings before and they've been in there for about probably almost an hour. Oh, here comes the cat. All right, so I'm clearly not a professional when it comes to liquid liner, but you just keep practicing, that's all you do. And I'm just gonna fix the 
Where is my concealer? I'm just going to take a little bit more concealer right here. I'll make this line a little more sharp. I'm going to take this brush, the concealer brush. Just kind of like make that eyeshadow line a little sharper. Oh, my cat is jumping in the box that had all the pharmacy makeup in it. He is crazy. And I'm just going to take a little bit more of the pressed powder, which is right here. For some reason, this pressed powder does not like to open. I don't understand what is going on here. All right, so, sorry, my nose is running. Now, I'm gonna use, <laughs> I'm so gross. I'm gonna use the um, Star Look Mascara, which looks like it's the bomb diggity. I love the brush on it. Like, look at the brush. Okay, snow puff. You can't do this right now. Get out here. Come on. It likes to be in everything. Ooh, this is nice mascara. I'm like usually a mascara snob. Like, I've only been using, um, the Better Than Sex Mascara, and then this is other one that I've been using. I can't remember what it's called, but those are like the only two that I like. But this one's really nice. It really doesn't clump either. Like, there's some mascaras that when you put it on your eyelashes, it leaves like this like clumpy stuff. This does not do it. And again, this mascara is the more expensive one that we have in our line. Um... But some of the other ones, I think this one's like 19 or something. There's other ones that are cheaper. But this is really nice. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? This is so nice. I love this mascara. I just really like the brush. It's really nice. And of course I got it up here. Why wouldn't I? Whatever. Like, why do I have to get makeup all over the place? I'm such a slob. Like, why do I do this? And this stuff is so strong, like, it stays on that, like, I can't even get it off with my spit. There's that.
feel like I could darken one of my eyebrows. I have OCD, guys. I can't help myself. All right, now let's do the lippy. I think, um, look how pretty this looks. I think I'm gonna do more of like a lighter color. I might do the brave. Is this brave? Yeah, this is brave. So, and this is matte. Oh, this smells good too. All their stuff smells so good. This is nice because it's not like drying feeling. It's very like, I don't know, this feels good. So that's brave. And this is my full look. How pretty that looks. It's gorgeous. So we are running a deal. Um, we are doing a glam pack this month that is, of course, I didn't buy the last product because I'm an idiot. Um, that is um, the Finish Lock Spray. It's like the one product I forgot to get. So the glam pack is our deal of the month. It is six products. Hold on. Is it six? It's, um, so it's the, you can get one of the primers. You can get this one or one that like gives more of a strobe effect. This with your uh where is it where did i put it uh a vfx foundation a concealer a the finishing powder yes yeah, so it is six products the finishing powder the double-sided brush and the locking spray all for 95 dollars tax and shipping included that's a crazy deal so you can get like pretty much your whole face obviously not with the makeup and stuff but all the face for under 100 so that's the deal we have going on right now um, if anyone's interested you can send me a dm and i can um, color match you um, for the foundation so there's that um i think that's everything i'm gonna probably go and watch one of my friends sing tonight um so um, and again, if anyone is interested in the opportunity, it's only $19.95 to join. Um, and then you get 50% off of all the products, like all these products that I bought, I can't even tell you how much they cost. Like it's crazy cheap, like 50% off of everything. Like I went nuts. Then I'm probably obviously going to buy more too, because there's some other stuff I want to get. So this is my look for tonight. It looks beautiful, right? Thank you all for watching. Now I'm going to go take my chicken out of the oven. Good night guys.